Before we start the video, I just want to explain that I closed the comment section because there are bots that come to answer comments and tell you to message somebody on Instagram and then they will hack your account. If you have any questions, join my Discord server down below in the description. So guys, so many people have been commenting last days about them losing their accounts and that the solution I've made before or the videos I made before did not work. So I just wanted to make a new video and explain how to get your account back in case it got disabled because of age or because anything suspicious that you did or you just want to learn about this so in case it happens for you you will be able to resolve it so first things first you go to user settings in case you still have the account you go to privacy and safety you go to standing and you check your account standing so if it's unlimited very limited at risk it means that you did something that broke the discord in terms of service or community guidelines and that you need to take action and stop doing that and it will actually appear right here which violation that you did and what actions that you should do but what we talk about is once your account is on suspended because when it's there it means that your account has been banned literally so it can be temporarily and it can be permanent so so in case it's temporary you still can not contact discord but it's always better to wait until it ends but if it's permanent now it's serious issue because you're losing your account forever and that's when you need to contact discord's team so you open this page you will find the link down below you click on here and then you choose appeals and each update right and then you type your email address right here and then how can we help you select appeal and action taken on my account or bot and then what would you like to appeal on my account and then the subject which is banded account for example and then in the description you're going just to put some details so for example hello discord so i got my account suspended for spamming but thing is but i think that i did not do it on purpose because i actually like and my internet was bad which caused the message to be sent more than once uh, for example, this is this issue actually happens to a lot of my friends who have bad internet connection and you can actually drop some files right here, add some files so you can confirm to them that you have a bad internet or that you did lag or even if you recorded a video of that moment, you can send it right here because it will help a lot. Now, this is the case if you were spamming and you can actually apologize and stuff, you know. But in case the reason is something else, for example, harassment or bullying or whatever, I don't think that you're going to get your account back. I mean, what you waiting for? Are you waiting for Discord to forgive you for doing such thing? But anyway, so you tap here the reason, which reason, and then you explain to them what happened transparently and hopefully Discord are going to be helpful with you. Now, actually, this one is for the suspended account for other reasons than age what if i got banned because of age now you come here and then how can we help you select update my age information and then you type here your date of birth so month zero three and then the day eight zero eight and then the year for example 2004 and then right here you tap the subject you can keep a suspended account or you can add age right here age for you anyway it's just the title it does not matter now as you can see change the reason for age being underage for example i mean i'm bad I'm, I'm really bad at describing and writing stuff like this especially when on when i'm recording videos i don't know my mind just blinds out but anyway you explain to them right here i am i am 18 years old not 13 minus and yeah and then you choose right here and as you can see we need some information to verify your age and identity in addition to information provided above please upload a photo of yourself in the photo you must be holding your photo id which clearly shows your date of birth and a piece of paper with your discord's username so as you can see, you should do this. So you should be in the picture holding your ID that must show your date of birth and then a piece of paper with your Discord username. And then you drop the file right here and then you click on submit and you will send the request to Discord and hopefully they will give your account back. Now another point that I never explained in the channel is how to keep an eye on the ticket that you just opened or how to check your request if Discord has seen it, did they not answer and everything about it? So, in the previous videos, I told you to keep checking your emails because in the email, Discord are going to answer. Now, this is correct, but it's not accurate. So, what to do is just come to the website again, 
click on sign in and then you will type the email address that you send the request with for example i'm gonna type mine but if you do not have an account in the discord support website just click on get a password right here and then you type the email that you use to send the request to discord and then you click on submit and you will receive some email that will help you set a password for your account and as you can see you will see all your requests right here and the subject and the id and you can see the status actually if it's solved if it's still open look at this discord are weird one month ago and it's still open they did not close it wow literally wow if the ticket that you've sent has been solved and once you check it for example you click on it you will find an answer right here discord answered you so if the answer that you find right here is not sufficient you can just keep sending some follow-up and then it will take you to this website and you can just answer right here and type some and then here you can just i still so in case you find the ticket that you just sent solved it means that discord answered your ticket so you click on that and if the answer is not sufficient or you find it not helpful you can just click on add conversation and tell them i still need help your answer is not sufficient or helpful or whatever you can just type right here and then click on submit and the status will become open again if it did help you don't forget to like subscribe to my channel and make a good comment so you can motivate me to to do more of these and if you have any questions please type please type them down below and i will see you in the next one goodbye my friends